Hi, I'm Lizzie Doolittle and this is Pinot de Ray. I came to having Pinot from uh, Dr. Newlands after he won the Grand National in 2014. Myself and Richard's eldest daughter um, started retraining him together. Um, I was then lucky enough to be offered to have him, to just retrain him at my yard. Um, so he joined me in February 2018 and then we just started retraining from there really, just slowly started doing pole work and a um, bit of dressage and showing him the ropes of eventing. He has nothing to prove because being a Grand National winner he's already, you know, he's a champion in a lot of people's eyes and mine. Um, so whatever he does, as long as he's enjoying it and having a nice time, that's all really that matters. When I'm riding Pino at competitions, people come over to him and say, oh my God, is that the horse that won the Grand National? And um, they don't really believe that he's out and looking so well and um, you know, competing at not a high level, but doing quite well at a level that most cobs or normal horses would struggle to do. So it just proves how clever he is. Yeah, he's the only horse on my yard that when you open the gate from the field, he'll just take himself into his own stable. And he's pretty chilled when he's there. And yeah, he just loves his life. I feel absolutely privileged to have him on my yard and uh, yeah, he's a complete yard favourite and we love him dearly. Pino lives out in the field with my retired three-star horse, um, JB. Uh, as you can see, they absolutely love playing together um, and they're best buddies. Thoroughbreds are so intelligent and such good athletes, um, so it's really important that they need to go on to do something else. Um, and to have had the opportunity to take on Pino and do what we do now is, you know, it's, it's, it's incredible. I've had the best time retraining him and he's just so rewarding. He just absolutely loves his job, loves working. Um, yeah, so we'll keep going for as long as we can.